What's up YouTube? Davey here again, back at it with another Pokemon opening for you. I am freaking excited right now. I actually was able to pick up an Elite Trainer box, my very first one. Um, but guess which one it is. Yeah, a freaking Fates Collide Elite Trainer Alakazam box. I found this at Target, did a little bit of research online, apparently they don't or they aren't supposed to hit shells until the 4th of May. Um, so I got a little bit early here, which is pretty cool. Um, apparently Target don't give no craps about it. So I want to go ahead and open it right now. And then uh, see what we get. Um, and I know that I've been pushing back the Ashker Ninja box. And I do apologize. Everything got so crazy on Saturday. I wasn't able to do a video. Um, but I'm going to make up for it with this uh, Fates Collide Elite Trainer box. So stay tuned and let's see what we get. Alright guys. With no ado further. This is the unboxing of the Fates Collide. Elite Trainer box, the first box that came out for the new set. Um, again, like I said in the introduction, this is supposed to be hitting shelves May 4th. Don't want, don't know why this was on the shelf of my Target store. Uh, maybe different stores have different release dates they can put on there. Not sure, no idea. Don't really care about the details at this point. I just want to go ahead and pop open this sucker and uh, see what kind of things we get. I've only been reading a little bit about the Fates Collide set, so um, don't really know too much to expect here. But what comes in the Elite Trainer box is 8 Fates Collide Booster Packs, 65 card sleeves for Mega Alakazam. See that little picture right there? Really cool. We have 45 Pokemon Energies, a Player's Guide for the expansion, 6 damage counter dice, um, 1 competition legal clip. Clip, yeah, coin flip die, um, two acrylic condition markers, pretty cool, and a code card, and of course you have the box, and it comes with dividers, I can put stuff in, oh, I'm so excited, so we're going to go ahead and get going and open this, um, hopefully I don't destroy the cover, because I actually like that, I might put that on the wall, um, but here we go. Sorry, I had to cut the video right there. I was ill-prepared with the necessary tools to help me open the packaging. Um, so instead of, you know, running out and leaving the camera to record and waste precious, precious data, I just cut the video so I can go grab something. So I have my trusted little knife right here. Let's go ahead and get into it ever so carefully. All right. Kids, don't use knives. Use scissors. And let's get into this box. All right, here we have it. Not too difficult there. The uh, sleeve back there just kind of slips right off the box, as you saw. Behind it was this really cool Fates Collide uh, Player's Guide. Um, probably just letting you know the ins and outs of the new cards and everything like that. So really cool collector's item to have right there. There's a shot of the back of that. Put that to the side. And here is your really, really cool looking box. Get you a 360 view of that. Um, same alakazam on each side. And it opens up like so. Look at all the goodies right there. Um, looks like these hold them up. So looks like the box actually goes all the way down there um, to the bottom. So very cool all right so just coming from the top of the box looks like we have those energy cards here bundled up looks like it's all sorts of different energies um yep pretty much i'm gonna keep them bundled here um just so i can kind of store them a little bit easier later um and then Look at these. What are these supposed to be? Oh, these are the little dividers that come in the box. Really cool. Look at that Alakazam right there on the cover. Fates Collide logo in the back. So I'm assuming, yeah, they just divide your cards just like that in there. Really cool. Let's put that to the side. We have some more box stuffers. Throw that away. We have the damage die. These are freaking cool right here. Oh, man, I've always wanted to get damage die for the game, so now that they come with that, very awesome. 
here is the card sleeves for the Alakazam. Oh man, this is so exciting. Very cool, very cool art on that one right there. Put that to the side. And then we have, oh, massive, massive. Oh, look at that. Look how many boosters there's here. There's a, a box code two right there. Um, I will have something special planned for all the box codes that I have collected so far. Um, probably some kind of contest going to happen with that. Um, here's the eight boosters. We got the Break Del Fox, Break Lugia on the cover, your Genesect, Mega Alakazam, another Break Del Fox, another Break Lugia, another Genesect, another Alakazam. Oh, I can't wait to open those. And last thing in the box here, like they said, um, you have your special uh, status counters or coins right here. Really, really, really cool. All right, I'm excited, man. Let's just go ahead and pop into these things. Um, I'm gonna separate the covers. Looks like you get two of each of them. Um, so, look at that. Oh man, I don't even know which one to get into next. Let me adjust the camera a little bit here. A little bit wider view. All right, you know what? Let's do the Genesect. Let's do the Genesect one first because this looks freaking awesome. All right, just getting into there. Oh, I can't wait to check out the art on these cards right now. I'm going to go ahead and take it off camera just to not accidentally review, reveal excuse me, the code card. Um... I would assume it's the same card trick, so let's go ahead and do that. The three and two, let's get right into it here. All right, we're gonna start off with a Mancino here, Bronzor, Larvitar, Burmy, Seal, Wormadam, I've never seen that Pokemon before actually, a Zagarde, Oh man, look at that. I guess that's one of his forms there. Really cool. I don't know too much about Zagard, but Zagard or Zagarde, sorry for the pronunciation, but that looks so cool. Um, I got an Omanyte here. Got a Reverse Hollow Fennekin here. Oh, really, really cool. You know how I like my starters. Oh, that just makes me happy right there. And then let's see what we got for the rare. Oh, do you see that border? Holy crap, this is my first ever Fates Collide booster pack, and look what I'm about to get from there. What is this? A Genesect Full EX card. Holy cow. Oh my god. Look at that sucker right there. Jeez, that is a great looking card oh my god look at that that rear the fates collide symbol oh that is a beautiful beautiful card right there what I'm gonna do is this right here let me put that back in there I'm gonna put my pools right back there for you to see that is so exciting my first ever fates collide get an insane pull of that genesect ex card right there uh let's move down the line let's do the mega alakazam booster i want to move a little bit quickly i want to move not a little bit quickly um because there is a lot of packs and i want to get through them all without uh boring everybody of course or making the video too long so i'm off camera to not accidentally reveal the code card um, I assume you can start redeeming the Fates Collides one, so let's go ahead and do that. So apparently the card trick is going to be the same here. Um, just the three and two that you saw me do earlier worked out perfectly. Let's do that again. Let's hope for some really cool stuff. All right, we're going to start off with your seal. And sorry for the sweaty palms. I see how excited I am right now. Uh, we got your Fennekin, Gothita, Binacle. Meow, Chintino, Ah, Kangaskhan. Oh, look at the art on that Kangaskhan. Ooh, that is really cool. Get four energies for 100 damage. I would do that. 120 hit points. Oh, I would definitely play with that card right there. Uh, we never can pronounce him. Uh, Dwaysian. Reverse Hollow of a Pupitar. Really cool. 
and for the rare all right it's not going to be another ex card it looks like but let's see what we get we had a Mr. Mime rare, but non-hollow. Still cool looking Mr. Mime right there. Love how they changed the art on that one. Very awesome. Whew. Getting very, very excited here. All right, let's move down the line and do the Lugia Break one. Ah, be awesome we pulled a Lugia Break out of the Lugia Break booster art pack. Be very, very cool. All right. Too excited. I can't open up these, man. All right. Sorry, I'm off camera again. All right, let's do a card trick here. Uh, when I saw this box in store, oh, it was just, my heart was pounding. I wanted to get home and do this. So we're gonna start with a Meow, a Snivy, really cool looking guy there. Uh, so Losis. A Fennekin with the Chikorita. That's really cool. Really cute. Uh, Wismer. Gabuto. Ultra Ball Trainer. Shauna Trainer. Reverse Hollow Team Rocket's Handiwork. And what do we have? Another rare, uh, rare, excuse me, a Marowak non hollow. Look at that one. Oh, uh, the art on some of these are pretty wicked. Liking that so far. Alright, Del Fox Break cover here for the booster and you know what I'm I'm not gonna hold you guys back here's here's a code card right here there you go first fates collide code card uh, not sure if there's probably other uh, people on YouTube that's already uh, got something like this already and have had code cards but I'm sure there are but there's a code card for you guys right there let's do go ahead and get into this we're going to have a Mincino, a Diglett, wow, I haven't seen one of those in a while, a uh, Riolu, a Carbink, a Deerling, a Mega Catcher, ooh, it breaks in, very cool, we have N, oh, look at that reverse hollow Del Fox, which is a rare, holy cow, Look how pretty she looks right there, all mystical and stuff. Oh, that is a good, good looking card. And I actually like her attacks better than the uh, Breakthrough one. Really cool. That is very, very cool. Oh, <laughs> this attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to all Pokemon in play. That is... Look, only three energies. Any three energies and she would pretty much kick your ass. That is a very good card to have. And what do we have here? Alright, so our rare is going to be a Motham Lon Hollow. Really cool right there. Alright, the pull of the century right there for that pack, of course, is that Del Fox. Very awesome right there. Ooh, I'm getting some pretty good things going on here. So let's just move back to the front here and let's do the Mega Alakazam. Um, face Collide Art Pack right here. That's the second. So we're down to our last half of the boosters. Let's go ahead and get that rolling. Alright, let's go ahead and get into that for you. Oh man, I'm really excited here. I know the video is getting a little bit long there, so I'm trying to go speed through some of these. So we have a Gothica, a Mancino, a Wismer, another Fennekin, a Volabi, a Whimsicott, got a, uh, can't pronounce that, I'm so sorry, a De-Evolution Spray, a Reverse Hollow of a Seal, and we have a Holographic Lucario. Wow, he is a really cool Pokemon, and oh, look at that Mega Alexander in the background. What is he going to be up to? Oh, that is one, one wicked looking card right there. Oh, man. That Lucario is badass right there. Goodness me. All right, time for the second Genesect one right now. All right, let's go ahead and do the car trick. Get in there for you. All right, got your Wismer, Mancino, Cottony, Solosis, Volibee, Servine, ooh. 
energy reset. I've never seen that card before. Put as many energy attached to Pokemon you'd like in your hand. Hmm. Could save some energy there. Got a Pupitar. <gasps> and we have a Lugia break card. Oh my god. That guy is mess you up. Look at that flash of destruction. 150 damage. You can use any energies you want, but you have to discard two energies to play that move. But look at him. He can essentially kill another version of him. <laughs> wow. A Lugia break. We were just talking about getting one of those, and we got one. But it's not over because I have one more card here. And what we're going to pull is a Snorlax. Oh, look at that guy right there. He looks so comfy. It is a non hollow, but it is still rare. It is very cool. Wow. And look at that move. Swallow, heal from this Pokemon the same amount of damage you did to your opponent's active Pokemon. And that is 50. Oh, that is. That probably is going to be an unstoppable card there. Wow. Let's take one more look at that Lugia break. Awesome. All right. Very, very nice going on there. All right. And look, Lugia break. Talking about that guy right there. Very cool pool. So let's go ahead and jump right into the next one here. Again, it was the Lugia Break um, art right there. All right. Give me something good out of these one, guys. I'm going to start with that uh, Fennekin, Gothita, Binacle, Meow, Wismer. Halucha. Oh, that's a different artwork right there. Doing his backflip. Very cool. Uh, Dome Fosso Kabuto. Altaria Spirit Link. A reverse hollow of that Marowak we got earlier. So it is a rare reverse hollow. So we're going to get two rares in this one. And the next card is going to be a Mandibuzz. Non hollow, but very cool dude. Always uh, had a weird feeling about that guy. Like a good weird feeling, but I don't know. He's kind of scary looking. So down to our last Fates Collide. And uh, whew, all the pulls we got so far. It's, it's, been, it's been real. It's been really awesome. Alright, let's go ahead and get down to the last one here for us. And, uh, oh wait, I forgot I'm supposed to put the cool pools over there. Ah, uh, well, we won't worry about it. <laughs> I'm too excited right now. Uh, let's do the meow. We got Binacle. We got Snubble. Taking a nap there. We have the Snivy. Another Solosis. Warbadam. Random Receiver. King is on again. I love that card. We have the Reverse Hall of Shauna. And then we have a Lucario. This is a different looking one. non hollow, but it's different art. So it looks like we have uh, two different types of Lucario art there. Very cool. Ah, oh, goodness me, goodness me. All right, let's go ahead and uh, round up our pulls and do a quick recap on them. Um, I'm going to pull the cool ones I see here, actually, with the uh, pulls that I've got as well. Um, I'm going to be jumbling for just a second here, so bear with me on that one. Alright, let's see here. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at all the pools that were pretty cool on this one. Uh, of course, we have that Reverse Hollow Rare Delphox card. Looker, very beautiful right there. I wonder if they're ever going to make a psychic version of her. I think that would be cool. Then we have the holographic rare Lucario. The Mega Alakazam in the background there. Then we have that Lugia Break card. Definitely my favorite pool of this box. Then we had that reverse holo rare of the Marowak. Then we have the reverse holo Fennekin. I'm showing this because, you know, starters are my favorite. And then we have that really cool Zagarde one. Um, I don't really know all of his forms, so I thought this one was pretty cool. It looks like kind of like a, a 
dog with the thing reminds me of like a houndoom. And then of course we got the Genesect full art EX card. Very cool. Very happy with this purchase, with this investment, I guess you would call it. Uh, very cool to have a collection like this. And obviously I have another box I can put my uh, fair Pokemon cards in. Um, so very awesome to see that. Um, so a couple of things, I did make a new Instagram, so check that out. Um, I will link it below for you. It's just going to be about my Pokemon. As you've probably seen before, I use my personal Instagram. Now I'm going to use my um, new Instagram for that. And yeah, pretty cool. Just subscribe to me for some more content. I'm going to have a couple of different things. I've got some blisters I picked up. I got the Dark Rye Mythical Box. You can kind of see it in the background over there. Um, just sitting over there waiting for me to open, as well as the Greninja Box. I know I'm really late for that one, but I will get to it. Um, schedule's just been kind of weird. So um, thank you again for coming back and watching my videos. I do appreciate that very much. Um, please subscribe to me. Please follow everything below. And thank you again for watching.